Captain's Log, Stardate 121923. The tension aboard this ship... Blast! It's happening again! The tension aboard this ship is suffocating. The sound of the crewmates' footsteps used to put me at ease, knowing that we were being efficient with our mission. A tight crew on a tight ship. But our routine assignment has taken an unexpected turn. The crew, once a unified force, is now divided, leading us to unspeakable tragedies. My task now is to craft a savior to help us save this mission, to save this ship. Hello, Red. Everything okay? Red's presence was routine, but what was that sidelong glance before departing? Suspicious indeed. What secrets lie behind that face shield? Are they truly focused on their duties or merely biding their time, waiting for the opportune moment to strike? The ship systems hum softly for now. Crewmate Green's arrival prompts a surge of paranoia in me. Could they be the one responsible for the sabotage that plagues our vessel? Maybe. Perhaps. Yellow, a trusted member of our crew, enters as well, but trust has become a luxury we can no longer afford. Each movement, each action is now scrutinized for any hint of betrayal. Could it be that even Yellow conceals a dark agenda? The inevitable occurred during our emergency meeting two nights ago. Accusations flew like charged particles in space. The vote was cast, and crewmate Rose was ejected into the void, their innocence not exposed until it was too late. What have we done? Another emergency meeting last night, another accusation. This time we were sure it was Lime. Lime. Their protests suddenly silenced as they were expelled, leaving behind unanswered questions that echo through the corridors even now. Time has proven ruthless and paranoia has become our constant companion as I make this entry documenting our descent into chaos. I cannot help but feel the weight of impending doom. The air crackles with uncertainty. The truth remains elusive. And with the placement of this final piece, crewmate Purple lives. Go, go little one, and rescue us from our fate. Find the insidious imposter lurking within our ranks. And in that unforeseen moment, the imposter's blade found its mark. Betrayal burns through me as darkness claims my vision. The captain's log ends here, a testament to the unraveling of trust and the chilling reality that some threats hide in plain sight until it's too late. We went up to the register with two Jawas in hand and I fully expected the cashier to tell us, no, you can't buy two of the same thing in this store. What are you thinking? But no, the cashier just rang them up like it was nothing. 